This is going to be a really quick video on how to make uh, Texas toast. I know in Texas you can buy it in the freezer section and it's called Texas toast. But it's a garlic bread and this is a frugal way of making it. And this you can pick up at Walmart for a dollar. Of course this is from my favorite recipe website called BudgetBites.com. You just slice this up, apply the spread, and then put, I put it in baggies, date it, and then just put it in the freezer. So the recipe calls for one stick of butter, and you want to leave that butter out for a little bit so it will be easier to, to mix with olive oil, be able to spread it onto the bread. It calls for two tablespoons of olive oil, four cloves of garlic and I just use this I don't have any fresh garlic so I'm going to use this in the jar and salt some dried parsley flakes and it is called homemade freezer garlic bread I got the loaf sliced and there's 21 slices. I am sure that the box of Texas toast does not have 21 slices. Okay, I'm going to add one stick of butter, two tablespoons of olive oil, four cloves of garlic, one a quarter teaspoon of salt, a tablespoon of parsley, and you just want to mix that together until it's mixed up real good and then we'll spread that onto the bread. Okay, I've got this all stirred up. So now I'm going to just take a slice of bread and put the garlic mixture on there and then so I just put a little bit of the butter garlic mixture on one side. No need to buy the expensive stuff already made so I put these all in a storage bag and then I will put them in the freezer like this and they will freeze and anytime you need garlic bread you'll have it I have two pieces in the oven and I have one two, three, about three and a half baggies full of garlic bread. So here's the finished product, the garlic bread and my ravioli pasta. So just wanted to show you how the garlic bread turned out. It looks really good.